Two of President Trump's closest advisors are now linked to the House impeachment inquiry. We're learning tonight that one of the president's cabinet members listened in on his controversial phone call with Ukraine's leader. Now, this comes as House Democrats subpoenaed the president's personal attorney. Nicole Killian is at the White House. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo was seen entering the White House for a meeting with President Trump hours before leaving on a scheduled trip to Europe. CBS News has confirmed Pompeo was on the July 25th phone call between President Trump and Ukraine's leader. Last Thursday, the secretary was asked about the whistleblower complaint that launched the impeachment inquiry. I haven't had an, uh, a chance to actually read the whistleblower complaint yet. Uh, I, I, I read the first couple of paragraphs and then got busy. Also in the crosshairs, the president's personal lawyer, Rudy Giuliani, who stated multiple times that he has tried to get officials in Ukraine to investigate former Vice President Joe Biden. Three House committees subpoenaed Giuliani for every document linked to his personal trip to Ukraine, writing, you acted as an agent of the president in a scheme to advance his personal political interest by abusing the power of the office of the president. Joe Biden was sent to Ukraine to in part deal with corruption, and he helped to corrupt the Ukraine. President Trump has suggested the whistleblower could be charged with treason or worse and tweeted he deserves to meet his accuser. Well, we're trying to find out about a whistleblower. We have a whistleblower that reports things that were incorrect. Another phone call is also raising questions. CBS News has learned Attorney General Bill Barr asked President Trump to call Australian Prime Minister Scott Morrison to help the Justice Department investigate the origins of the Russia probe. The DOJ confirms it has asked President Trump to contact several other countries about the matter. Nicole Killian, CBS News, the White House. Majority Leader Mitch McConnell confirmed today he would hold a trial in the Senate as per Senate rules if the House passes articles of impeachment.